slingshot session. Oh my gosh, healing is happening. It's happening, people. Yesterday had the best vibrations in that session when we were all tapping together. I'm gonna do vlogmas again this year. I need to figure this out. Eyes were like rolling in the back of her head. Like, mama, I've made it. I've officially made it. Good morning, my friends. Welcome back to my vlog. If you're new here, my name is Haley Hoffman Smith, and I'm the friend that helps you bring your pipe dreams to life through manifestation and motivation. I just got back from Paris yesterday, and I'm about to kick off a big week in New York City. I launched this program called Slingshot Sessions a few weeks ago, and it starts tomorrow. The sessions are 90 minutes each, and we're doing group EFT tapping to remove any subconscious blocks around we have money, the fear of being seen, love and relationships, and productivity and motivation. So this week we start those. We have all four of those sessions and then I cannot believe, I, my mind is blown with how much we sold. So I also have about 13 group coaching sessions that I'm spreading out over the next two weeks and a lot of one-on-one -on -one coaching sessions for both slingshot sessions and my normal coaching clients. So my schedule has never looked more packed, but I honestly feel so excited about it. I feel a lot of momentum with it. Um, I feel very refreshed after my trip to Paris, even though I'm obviously a little bit jet lagged. So I want this entire vlog to just be about getting your groove back on, like feeling excited with the change of the seasons. It feels like the holidays are coming in and I am obviously really busy all the time anyways, just because of coaching. But I think like, especially having almost like a marathon slash sprint over the next two weeks, especially this week with slingshot sessions and 150 total attendees. It's a fool getting your groove on, being your best self. I really want to get in the Peloton. Hey. Eating really healthy, drinking a lot of water, just doing everything so I am a complete and total vessel of sheer inspiration and content for the amazing participants and everyone in coaching. So anyways, it's Sunday. It was daylight savings today, which was amazing. I got in an extra hour of sleep, bringing my total hours of sleep last night up to 11 hours so needed after jet lag and such a long flight home yesterday and I'm gonna head to Central Park and do a little walkie walk with my best friend Ankita we're gonna grab lunch first um, just to have a little outing today and then I'll be back here for the Sunday night Oracle reading I'm gonna get my nails done for the week and just make sure I'm all set and ready to go for tomorrow yay for another vlog also loving this very furry cozy sweater from newly and this hat is from free people I haven't worn it since last year but I'm loving it let me show you a full fit look i feel like it's a perfect outfit for just walking in the fall so just my wearing my white sneakers i wore them the whole time in paris they're my faves these are my spanx leather leggings looking good feeling good okay i'm ready to eat too so let's go to lunch okay we're about to do a taste test of these new starbucks lattes sugar cookie latte let's try it Good morning! It is day one of slingshot sessions. Josh did my hair this morning. I showered after my brief Peloton ride. I only did a 15 minute ride, but it was a hit ride, high intensity interval training. And I don't know what I did. I think I was like, oh, 15 minutes, I have to do my all. And I was honestly about to pass out. Note to self, don't push yourself just because it's only 15 minutes. I have just transformed my desk area so that it's facing out, honestly, so that the light can come in. But I also think looking out at the city is amazing. I'm about to light my candle. I have my picture of my granddad and the smell of wood smoke always reminds me of him so i'm lighting this candle so i can feel his presence with me throughout slingshot sessions we're getting started and i'm hopping on with one of my team members in about 30 minutes just to 
go over the run of show. Each slingshot session is 90 minutes long. So you only have one today, one tomorrow, one Wednesday, one Thursday, but there's also a lot of group coaching, a lot of one-on-one -on -one coaching. So it's gonna be a good day. I'm like kind of already out of breath. Woo! This morning's session is on money blocks. We're doing group tapping. So I'm getting like a fun playlist up and going for it. Uh, we're gonna be doing a lot of rewiring. It's gonna be amazing. And I'm just setting my intention on that it is a truly amazing session and leads to incredible transformation and breakthroughs for everyone involved. Yay! 150 attendees. Isn't that not insane? I think on this morning session, because people got to choose which sessions they wanted to join in on. In this morning session, I believe we have something around like 65 participants. So we got this. <laughs> okay, let's do this. Okay, I went right from for the first slingshot session into group coaching. And I just finished, I'm about to make a very healthy salad and a few gluten-free chicken nuggets are in the air fryer. I am starving, so I think that will help so much. But first thoughts, it just went really well. It went so well, it was really cool to see how as we were doing the group tapping, I would ask like, okay, share in the chat, like, does it feel lesser? The thing we were tapping on and everyone was like, less, 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 it's gone, zero. And it was just so cool to see firsthand like, oh my gosh, healing is happening. It's happening, people. So I got good stuff at the grocery store yesterday to make one of my favorite salads, baby arugula, some feta cheese, and then I love making my own dressing with lemon juice, just like squeezing some lemons, adding some olive oil, and a few spices. And if I'm feeling funky, I might add some raspberries. <laughs> day two of slingshot sessions this morning our topic is on the fear of being seen it's gonna be such a good one I'm really pumped after how well yesterday's went I'm gonna run to Starbucks and get a pumpkin spice latte yes even though it's kind of like well the holiday drinks are out I'm still enjoying the pumpkin spice latte most I tried the well you guys saw that <laughs> the horrid taste test of the sugar cookie latte was not it so some good pumpkin vibes. We're getting started in a little less than an hour, so I'm just gonna make sure everything is ready to rock. But again, yesterday had the best vibrations in that session when we were all tapping together and dancing and clearing blocks, so I have high hopes for today to follow in that same vibe. <laughs> this is like a brand new methodology with group tapping. I was kind of something I channeled and I was like, I guess this could work, but it was kind of a leap of faith to be honest. I don't want to like say that before I actually tried it. And it worked really well and it makes me really excited for like the future of being able to help more people. So day two, baby. Okay guys, it has been an amazing day. Two group coaching calls, one one-on-one, -on -one, one slingshot. And I'm gonna go on a walk with Ankita so I can get some fresh air, get a little social engagement. I haven't like seen anyone since Sunday. Um, and then come back in time for a call with my manager. So yeah, let's go. Yay! It is Wednesday evening. I am settled in at home. I have my third slingshot session on love and relationships. Ooh, in a few hours. Um, so I'm just chilling, but I've been a terrible vlogger because it's been such a busy week. However, I found a dedicated gluten-free website restaurant. I clearly need to eat ASAP and I'm very excited. I ordered a burger from there and tiramisu. I haven't had gluten-free tiramisu in forever. So I'm just going to chill, watch some Gilmore Girls eat this before the session because I did so much tapping today with clients and tapping always makes my head like woozy and I want to be super game on for tonight. The burger has a gluten-free bun and then I got truffle fries. Okay, I did a very dangerous thing and I took a little 20 minute nap. I was so tired, but I woke up in time and now we have like 10 minutes, 10 minutes until slingshot. <laughs> I need to figure this out before I get on this. Slingshot sessions number three is on love and relationships. Ow, ow. Got my pumpkin candle lit and ready. 
it's such a different experience to be doing this at night, 8 p.m. to 9.30, especially when it's been dark for so long. I feel like I kind of liked starting out the day the last two days with the slingshot, slingshot sessions, but I do think it's good with tapping to go to sleep right after. So I think we'll all get nice and healed, nice and woozy, and then go right to bed. Let's do this, number three, baby. Hello guys, I have just had the most hectic week. I should have been a better vlogger, but I have literally been on calls the entire day, every single day. It's Thursday, Ankita's on her way over and we are going to make a steaks. I made everything look very nice. <laughs> I think I just needed an experience that wasn't like me eating takeout on the couch in between work. Tonight is the last slingshot session. It's gonna be on productivity and motivation. And tonight, Red by Taylor Swift comes out, the re-release. I'm so excited. I feel like I'm kind of reverting to childhood. I've been the biggest Taylor Swift fan since, honestly, before a lot of people knew who she even was when I was 11. So, very special and important to me. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to make it till midnight for the release, but I'm gonna try my best. I'm just very, very tired. It's been the best week. But when you're doing so much tapping, your brain kind of gets like, whoa. Anyways, look how gorgeous it looks in here. More cooking content coming here shortly. It was so easy when we met. Okay, I just finished my last slingshot session. Slingshot session! And I'm got to join in. She was just out here in the living, living room watching on her laptop when I was in the office. It was so funny, guys. I don't know how many of you tap, but when you start tapping like this, if you really get into it and your chin is down, so like you're really open to your subconscious mind, sometimes you can kind of go into a trance. And for that song, <laughs> that sense has really happened to me when I tap with Kaylee because I think we're just so close and connected that I like the guards she come down. She feels like she's yeah willing to access her subconscious. I'm like what well, yeah like I'm more emotional I would say than usual and so sometimes I'll literally like stop tapping because I black out like I'm like, her eyes were like rolling in the back of her head and I was like she's gonna scare people she used to turn her camera. Off. I was like but anyways on the like, <laughs> sessions I was like on video and I was like okay all of Haley's like you know all her friends and all her followers are on um all you guys are on video and i was like i don't want to scare anyone and so i was like i was like don't go don't like stay on top of it keep <gasps> tapping keep tapping but it was really good i worked through a lot of my vlogs Woo! Oh, it was so good i'm sad it's over i cannot believe it's over i mean it was so cool honestly to see so many people's lives change on camera like it was my Aww. first time being on one of Haley's like shot sessions and it was so cool just to see how many shifts people are having across the entire zoom call and it was such a safe environment too because there was a time too that a girl was like well what if like sh like maybe she wasn't fully having a shift during that one round of tapping and so she was like well what if xyz what if abc and all of us stopped and you were like, okay, well, let's come up with an affirmation together. Like, let's figure this out together. And I thought that was really cool. So Aww. if anyone's considering it, if you ever do it again. Wow, best marketer. She's you should do it. <laughs> you make her a steak, she'll say what you want. Just kidding. <laughs> she cooks the steak. I know this was such a short vlog and I was working the whole time, but I'm going to wrap it up here. Tonight, Red comes out at midnight. I'm honestly so tired. I don't think I can stay up another hour and a half. Like, look at me right now. I am so out of it. But I will forever remember this night because basically I commented on one of the TikToks by the Empire State Building, like their official accounts, because they were turning the Empire State Building red in honor of red. Basically, Taylor Swift commented on the same TikTok. So they made a TikTok with a screenshot of that. And somehow I am the only other comment. Like it shows Taylor Swift and the Empire State Building. So it's Taylor Swift, Empire State Building, and then me in the Empire State Building telling me to DM them. Like, mama, I've made it. I've officially made it. It. So sleepy after such a good week of slingshot sessions. I'm so gonna do them again. It was just the greatest thing ever. Really excited for more vlogs. I'm gonna do Vlogmas again this year. I don't know if I'm gonna do daily vlogs. Let me know what you would think of me doing vlogs like every two to three days just because my work schedule is gonna be really hectic. I want all my videos to be really good rather than something I like throw together. So let me know your thoughts. Very excited for my first Christmas and my new apartment with plenty of room for a nice big tree and Christmas decorations. I love you guys so much. Thanks for being here. Big hugs.